Hello everyone, it's Dyla from Homesthetics, and in today's video, we're going to paint a lake. For this painting, I'm using Sennelier watercolors that come in a pan of 12 colors, making it practical for outdoor painting, as it comes with a small brush and a strap on the bottom. I'm using the Princeton Elite Aqua Brush, which is the best brush for handling wet-on-wet -wet technique, and it comes in a set of five brushes at a reasonable price. Let's get started with the video. The first thing we need to do is sketch the lake, foreground, and hills. I prefer to make a rough sketch and leave the details for later during the coloring process. The first step is to paint the lake using the wet-on-wet -wet technique which is one of my favorites when it comes to painting backgrounds like the sky, sea, or lake. Then, we can move on to the hills, mixing dark and light green to create highlight and shadow areas. For the foreground, I use more colors to create depth, with the object closest to us being more pigmented or having the clearest shape. I paint the grass using the small brush and add a tree on the left side, then let it dry for a while. The next step is to add the second layer to the lake, using a flat brush to create the texture of the water with more dark blue color. For the second layer of the hills, I leave the middle part light and the right side darker to create depth. Thank you. 
Then we can go back to the details of the tree using a detailing brush and darker color to create texture. We can add more branches and twigs to fill up the upper part of the painting. And for the bottom, we can add more grass with a thick consistency of color. In the next step, we can paint the clouds and add more details to the lake. And voila, the lake painting is complete. 
I hope you enjoyed this video, and stay tuned for more exciting painting videos in the future!